All right, so I'm just mainly documenting this, so like, I don't really know why I'm bored. And I'm supposed to be keeping an eye on Rex right now, who is the giant horse that we'll get to in a few minutes. Um, this is where he went down initially the other day. It's really hard to tell, but it's like bent down in there. Here's the area. Muddy as hell. So he was back down in there against that. Called the fire department. Called the tow truck. Towed him up. Up, up, up this way. It's this giant pile of poop that's still here. He got pulled up to here. The pouring rain on Thursday night. All this hair on here. Hopefully, we were maybe hoping he'd get his footing. We found a little Rexy poo down here yesterday morning. He was there Thursday night, Friday morning. Friday morning, called another tow truck. Had him hauled back up here through this drag mark all the way up here. do here. And since then, he has slowly moved himself down here. He's been going this way, and this way, this way, until we found him this morning where he currently is. Backed into a corner where the two fences meet. As you'll see, there's no longer a fence there because we had to take it out. Because someone almost took his eye out. He's resting right now, but I don't think you guys understand. Like, he is huge and he cannot get up. Got a bunch of hay here. And he's just resting and hoping to get him here, but he's got a long way to go. Back up the left side up that way. I think he knows that. I think he's trying, but he just hasn't been able to. He is a sweetheart, though, and I really, really do not want him back up against there because I'm here alone, and I can't stop a 2,500-pound horse. And neither can other people, but they at least know horses. All right. Bye-bye, Rexy.